We read an article about um, Sam and Nia, but it wasn't just about them. It was about it listed like four other family vloggers, and just the whole thing ridiculed and just made a mockery of e even of God and of families and family vlogging, putting your family on the internet, and it was just just a horrible article. All seem like valid complaints. Why would you want to videotape your whole family, your kids who are extremely young, and put it on the internet for people to see who don't know you? and who basically anyone can get the information about, and then try to make a profit of it. Of it. Seems like perfectly valid critiques of this, of this terrible practice. I mean, of this type of video blogging content. And it's not even just that. I've been seeing, like, it just seems to be the trend right now to bash on family bloggers. <laughs> But I've noticed throughout all forms of social media and internet that... Now you may be wondering to yourself, right are they now the just talking about what attack. they set the whole video up to be? About, about the attack on family um, video bloggers? Seven, After 11 them, minutes like of nothing happening, they're finally talking about it? Thing. That's Literally the family vlogger way. Made a mockery of even of God and of families and family vlogging, putting your family on the internet, and it was just just a horrible. Because who could article. criticize any of this? And it's not even just that. Who in their right mind like, could? It just seems to be the trend right now to bash on family vloggers, accuse them of being fake, accuse them of a, like. Now, to be honest, I don't think these people are fake. I think they're just the widest motherfuckers you've ever known. To make viral videos and stuff like that, and just attacks on every angle on family and family bloggers. Makes me think. Because criticism on the internet is always a personal attack. Why are they under attack so much? Huh. Well, as far as I hear... Let's see what she thinks. Probably gonna get attacked for eating a mango and chewing with my mouth open. No, there's a so you see, whenever someone criticizes you for trying to exploit right your children, the, trying to get money out of filming the, their lives, uh, always shoving a camera in their face, and trying to use that to get views uh, and fame horror, off the internet, remember, they would get mad at you for eating a piece of fruit. So their opinion doesn't but matter. And they're just spiteful assholes. Good entertainment. That it's just real life. Who hate you and, and your gut. So people. they're obviously bad people too. And mix it with being a God-fearing family or even like Christian at all, and you. Because this video showed just how truly, like, truly Christian they were. Just, just showed how really how loving they were to their fellow man. The how more, they would the seek out and help everyone they could, all the homeless people and poor people and people who are really suffering in the world, and just to try to show the light of God a little bit every day to everyone. Shut up and stop. Because that's how Satan works. He finds that whatever <laughs> Because anyone who criticizes them are obviously set by Satan to try to shoot them off the path. Before. Brilliant, like this, brilliant. One of our Best favorite, arguing. And one of our biggest reasons why we do family vlogging, like, we love putting goodness out on the internet. Like, thank so you. We thank you for enough, this wonderful content. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, you, know, thank you for making internet. the world a truly and better place through this. And we're not gonna, and we're gonna continue doing it. You hear that? They're not gonna stop. They find more wholesome good things to watch than the crap that's been put out there by other sources and and maybe Because TLC's inspired, reality TV is really okay, crap. So I guess my point is So watch these people's life instead. Family, Something family that's so white bread and unoffensive that it makes you want to shoot yourself. So you can be closer to God. So. You know what? Even if they continue to attack family vlogging, we're going to There's continue. There's nothing we it. can do about that. The more you are getting attacked, the more you're probably doing something. You hear that, Hitler? So that's it. Well, oh, I'm sorry. We're end the vlog now. I'm we sorry. To, to, I'm things. sorry. That was totally Good uncalled for. Good night, everybody. Good night. Because obviously, people who get criticized or hated on or told they're wrong obviously must be doing something right. The more they are. Oh, and brilliant. And see, they're not trying to use a doctor's visit to get more views about their dying relative. No. Obviously, they're just trying to show that people do go to the hospital. If you watch it and donate them money and get them ad revenue, that's just a bonus of doing God's work. Oh, and with the title, they'll worry about my dad. That's why I'm going to shove a camera in his face. Because why wouldn't he want to be filmed with me next to him, right? Right, br brilliant. I just... Uh...
and bad vloggers is the next video. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you so much for this brilliant, 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 just a top of the class YouTube content. Thank you so very much. You guys sacrifice so much for the work of God. And truly, anyone if, anyone who criticizes you is obviously being used by Satan. Thank you. Well, the, so, so that was just a little defense of video blogging and video blogging families and why everyone who criticizes them are Satanists who are just trying to persecute them for being Christian and good people.